Seacrest. It is uh, Ryan Seacrest. We've got Jake Johnson and Max Greenfield from uh, New Girl, which airs at 9, 8 Central tonight on Fox. Boys, good to see you in person. Hey, thanks yeah. for having us. I this feel is like, awesome. I, how, how did, did it, we get you in? What, don't you just want to say entertain? Like, just go. Because the two of them are together. <laughs> they're always so funny. Yes, yeah, so we can make an arrangement where we can be here several times a week if <laughs> you like. As a duo. <laughs> we love that. What if we started this up as a new career, me and you? <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, I, all right, so you, got, you, <laughs> you you clearly have good chemistry on your show. Now, did, did you guys know each other well uh, or for a long time no, prior? we actually auditioned at the same time. They same were, day? Same day. Same day. They brought in For a bunch the same of, part? No. He was mm-hmm. always a Schmidt. I was always a Nick. Yeah. I don't think we could do the other one. <laughs> it would be a totally different show. It would be so gross when I like took off my shirt and I'm like, look at my six pack. Like, what six pack, Tubby? <laughs> it wouldn't quite be the same effect. It's always really funny though when you're auditioning with, with each other and, and just to the audition process in general, you know, you're you're so vulnerable at that stage because yeah. you can't hide the fact that you're just like, want me, please uh, hire <laughs> right. me. Please and that, me. Yeah, I think that, you you know, you try to find a friend during that and we've kind of found yeah. each other and then the audition process ended up being such a long thing, not only for us, but then finding the other roles on the show that we kind of just yeah. Max, I ended did, up yeah. hanging out We the also whole time. didn't quite know each other yet, so we did the audition and then we were like being cool bros around each other. We didn't realize what idiots we are. <laughs> so after we like gave the cool bro handshake. We're like, dude, it'd be really cool if it was you. We'll be all right <laughs> on, bro. And then we got we got the job, and then we had to come in for all these like chemistry reads with the other characters, like with Winston's character, yeah. who was coach at the time. But then we realized, like, oh, you know, we kind of at this at this stage, like no one really knew us. We kind of look enough like each other that during this process, it's likely that one of us is going to get fired, and they'll <laughs> overthink this. So we used to like text each other and say, hey, man. What are you wearing today? We don't. I don't want to look too much like you. And then it was like a <laughs> wardrobe true. thing every day, like because there was one day where we looked very similar, and we thought we we came this into is a, the day a that read. somebody's going, we, someone's we, going home. Yeah, we came into a read with the same color shirt, same jeans, kind of messy brown hair, and we looked over at all our executive producers and casting, going like this, like. Oh, oh, wait a second. Uh, we're like, no, no. Oh, no, 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 Always different. Always different. But and, and who found out they got the job first? I think same time. Same, yeah, same, same time. time. Yeah. yeah, package deal. It was the same night. Yeah. And uh, what a great feeling that is to know that you've got it. And then the fact that it, it's a hit. I mean, that, that's yeah, the next crazy. good thing. It's it's good. It's funny. It's unbelievable. It's, it's so awesome. Right? Yeah. The the first excited. This was the first time I booked a pilot. So hearing that was just such a rush in and in and of itself. Uh-huh. And then when we got to shoot it, you know, Zoe's so good, and Liz Merriweather, our writer, yeah. is so brilliant. So we kind of felt like we had something good, but it wasn't until we put it in front of people online and people really stood behind it. So you guys, obviously, you became close, and we know that you've kissed. Uh, how was it kissing each other? It I was mean, all right. I think that was yeah. on the show they yeah. kissed. But. Yeah. It was all right. Yeah, well, I think actually, Jake, Jake, was, Jake was against it at first, and I said just... Just go with it. Yeah, just go with it. Let yeah. it let it happen. Let uh-huh. it be free in the moment. Yeah. Matt's and improvised I, kissed me a bunch in the show. Yeah, <laughs> I've been trying to get it. Because, you know, we'll do a lot of improv on the show. And I'll just go in and kiss him sometime. And be like, please stop that. It's inappropriate. And I say, I think it works. But they usually don't put it in. And then finally they put it into the show after about the seventh time we had done it. Actually, all, all jokes aside, my character, I've been very fortunate. I've kissed a lot of attractive ladies in the show. Yes, uh-huh. But I've been the best person that you've ever kissed. That's not what I was going to say. <laughs> what I, was I, gonna, ju- I jumped it. I'm sorry. <laughs> you did jump it. What I was going to say is I have been kissed the most by Max in two seasons than any girl I've ever dated. <laughs> <laughs> and that's, a, that's honestly just a fact of life. At first, well, at first, the reactions from you were like really aggressive where you'd push my face away or you'd hit me. Yes, because you were then, improvising it. But yeah, but then, now when it happens, and a lot of times it's in the script, uh, he just kind of goes with it and just uh, accepted yeah. that this is now finally. part of the show. Yeah, he, thank you. Finally, yeah, that's right. Finally. Just the thought of the, the, the whiskers touching. <laughs> it's it, that, yeah. now it's I, okay. You know what I mean? It, I, I, spirit. I, I get why you would turn away. It's terrible. <laughs> you know? uh, like, we get it. You, you don't buy a guy a sweet. That's right. Well, I think there's actually two sides of that because I think half guys think there's nothing wrong with that. You can buy your buddy a cookie, and then there's another kind of man who says, absolutely no. not. <laughs> no. <laughs> that it's a sweet gesture, but you should never buy another man like a sweet, delicious Nothing. cookie. Like a, a, a 